baby, all over night. I'll make love to you like you want. Invite to join. Questions? Anyone watching can send questions. Put questions here. Okay, let's do questions, you guys. I'm in the oobs, very much giving private cloud traffic. So let's do something fun, yeah? I just be very cautious of Uber drivers. I don't want to get stolen. But let's do questions. I'm going to look on here and figure out how to do this. So excuse the furrowed brow. How does go this? How does do this? Tap a question to answer. Ah! <laughs> Technology. <laughs> um, my birthday is January 4th. I'm a Capricorn. This birthday is my 25th year of life. <laughs> I personally, I would like to, one, go somewhere fancy, somewhere island gal, island gal, or like Italy, Paris, something like that. LOL, we're supportive of that on YouTube. I, 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 T, T and Coco season two. I, I, I have no other time. Um, that's my birthday. Now how do I do another one? Are oh. Let's see. How is it saying? <laughs> oh. What song would you want to sample if you got the clearance? Hmm. This is a good question. I feel like Brandy, When You Touch Me, but I also really like um, a couple Party Next Door songs that I feel like I would want to like flip and do something with. Um, ooh, Frank Ocean, Thinking About You. That's what I want to flip. Something like, maybe like single ladies. Something that was like women empowerment. Flip it. Yeah. Hmm. Now that love's taking over. <laughs> Y'all send me with that. If you could have only released one song from the EP, which would it be? Meaning only one could have came out ever? I don't know. It might be giving double back for me. Mm, this isn't a hard question. I don't like these. I would say double back. Or I think crazy for me. Eek. I don't know. This question too hard. Why did I click that? Oh, I can see who many how many people liked this and then I can answer that. I'm not answering that. Headline next single. <laughs> Period. Lito. What's your favorite Marvel movie? It's giving. I I I only watch Black Panther. Sorry. Okay. You know what? Let me not even say that. Black Panther. Period. Amen. Sports movie. I like to laugh. Comedy is more where I live. Can Can we get her on this remix? That's what I've been saying. Everybody needs to blow her stuff up. Remember how y'all was blowing up Terrell to get me on the Terrell show? Everybody needs to blow up Jasmine and tell her to get on this remix, please. That would be so sickening. That's all I'm saying. Let's see. Um, me and Britt definitely need to collab. Would you want to guess her? I would want to guess star on Abbott Elementary. It's hilarious. 
Um, now that love's taking over. What? I wish I could just slide these, you know? Can't you just do that? What would you do to it? Okay. I do feel like people was confused about this. So, from what I'm a very teach me type of person. So, from what I understand, the track list originally, some could say, could flow better. And so, the reason that it was changed was so that start to finish, it kind of like meow, 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 melted into the next one. That's from what that's what I was told. And it does make sense to me. But I also, I don't know, I just don't, some things I don't think about until I think about them. And then I'm like, wish I would have thought about this sooner. How are you mentally, spiritually, physically? Let's see how honest I'm going to be today. I'm just kidding. Um, mentally? I'm definitely tired, but I feel in my purpose bag, which just takes a lot of energy sometimes. And I feel like I'd be getting asked a lot of questions that need answers ASAP Rocky. And I'd be like, huh? But it's taught me to be more productive on my thoughts. Not that that's so even there. I had to really tap into what I was feeling. Um, yeah. But also, I don't like when the opposite. When there's nothing to think about. And then I'm just bored thinking. Think about what I'm going to eat today. I don't like that. So, mentally, I'm very mentally stimulated. I guess that's good. Spiritually... I um, have started doing this thing on the, I don't know if y'all know the Bible app, but basically I don't be having time for the full devotionals, but I definitely want like to feed my spirit in some capacity. So I um, do like the, they're like two minute devotionals on the Bible app and they take two minutes and I feel like they're good. But I try to really like not do anything else but focus on that for two minutes. I feel like it helps better than nothing. Um, hmm. Physically, I just worked out for the first time in a long time. And boy, oh boy, are my gluteus muscles sore. <laughs> you know how when you try to work out to overcompensate? And then it's like, but you wasn't even, you're not even like that. So now look at you feeling goofy. That's me. A goofy goober. That was a good question, though. Thank you for asking. Headline next single is so funny. Oh, let's see. What did I do today? Was there anything interesting? Okay, I will say. My day was productive and cute. Cute because I did these interviews today, and sometimes I do interviews and I just literally turn into a zombie because I already know what to ask and I already know what to say. I've said it a thousand times, vibe, so it's given repeat. But today, I did this interview with this radio station at the UK, and so I was automatically more like, <gasps> because I love their accent, so it's so fun to like do my accent with them and see if they liked it. And um, they asked good questions. Oh, they asked, who's an artist that I would want everyone to watch in 2023? And I said, go, go, Moreau. And I liked that I got to talk about somebody else and give somebody else a moment. I'm tired of talking about myself. Um, and then I had another interview with the edition. 
and the, he asked some fire questions. He asked me, where is the line between Coco and Courtney? And I was like, that's a question for therapy. Saving it, writing it down. Um, Cause boy, oh boy, I do not know. I do not know, brother. Hmm. Then I went to do um, this thing, this other promo thing. I'm not even going to talk too much about it, but I just had another thought. But anyway, um, I got to have fun with Uncle Clifford on P Valley. Nico, he's hilarious, and he's really nice. Okay, yes, I did answer that. Whoops. Oh, my grog. Oh, I said yes, I would want to guest star on Abbott Elementary because I love dry humor. I love dry humor. I'm not the type, I don't think like, I don't think clown, clown, clown energy is that funny. I like more, what did he say? That's funnier to me. Yeah, so I would definitely be on Abbott Elementary. Let's see. Oh, so when I press X, they go away. Hmm. So for those of you who don't know, I got acupuncture on the wellness episode of Tea and Coco. I'm getting oiled down. And truthfully, I think I kind of liked it. But I don't want to reel and none of them putting them needles on me on camera. But, you know, I don't know. Remember when I said my back felt open? <laughs> it did. It felt like my energy. My back was like, raw. Does that make sense? Did you get lip injections? No. I did, um, the, the lady who did my makeup today, Diana, she does like a, her thing is to like overline the lips right here. I like it. It's giving me, but no. I used to not want, I want, I would want the opposite of lip injections when, when I was younger, but now I'm like, Oopsies. You guys might be onto something here. <laughs> Let's see. <laughs> um the dream collab. I love Brandy. I really would want to get I really would want to get us together. But I would also love to do a all girls power anthem. You remember when they was like "Voulez vous coucher avec moi ce soir?" I don't know what they was really saying, but it sounded cool. And they were all girls, and they all had the the, the idea. Okay, now if somebody says this idea, I'm gonna know something. I'm copywriting this. I don't even want to say this on live. Whatever I'm saying. So they were singing that song Moulin Rouge. Does that make sense? But it was all these different girls who sang different types of ways. I think, I think Lil' Kim was on there too, rapping. Something like that, where we're all singing, but like we all have our different styles. Yeah. Dream collab, that would, that would be what it gives. There's another song that does that. Or a song, no, this is too good of an idea. I'm not saying it on live. Should write it down though. Let's see. And that is what gets me. Something about Bel Airski. Hillary is still serving sickening, sickening looks. Um she Okay. She wears an outfit that is from a specific culture. And um that's all I'm gonna say about that. She, yeah. Okay, I think that's enough. I did vibes. I said this. Hillary wears an outfit. Her take on something culturey. Does that make sense? I hope it is. I did this one. Why the oops? Oh, this is a good question. Are you doing any music vids from the EP? By the way, EP fire emoji heart emoji thank you girl Are you okay? thank you king whoopsies um 
king can be a girl. <laughs> Woman king, period. Um, I am doing a music video from the EP. We're working on it right now because the choreo is going to give. Uh, 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 uh. Putting those pieces together is giving. It's difficult because I'm also filming and it's also the holidays. I'm trying, y'all. I'm trying, boss. That reminds me of something funny that only I would get. Um, eek. Definitely giving, hey, JJJ. Definitely giving touring at the top of the year. Honestly, we finished filming around January, February, March. Prayers till it stays in February because I would love to tour around March and be outside during the summer. I feel like it warms up around March, so that's perfect. Um, I'm touring though. I'm on somebody's stage. Come and see me. What do you mean what happened to my face? This right here? You know, she just was a little too perfect. She just was a little too work. I'm just kidding. She just was a little too perfect. What movie would you like to do now? Ooh, this is a good question. What movie would you... Dang, this drive me crazy. Mm, mm, mm. Sometimes I'd be so over LA. Sometimes it'd be giving traffic and it'd be like 11 p.m. on Sunday. You're really not at home? Don't you have work tomorrow? I mean, you don't want a meal prep or something? Like, what happened? Anyway. What movie would you like to do next? Action, drama, horror, comedy? This is a good question. I would have to do something that completely shakes ish up. And if I am doing a movie, it's going to be worth me pausing my music career again. Because OMG. Raw. Um, horror is scary because I'll be feeling like stuff be happening to the people that do the horror movies. And my Shondo. My Shondo. Unless I'm like the girl that comes in and I'm like, no, get out of here. And it's gone. And I save the town. But then that's not a horror movie. Um, so then probably not horror. I love comedy, but no. It would probably give action or drama. Like something sad, sad, where I can be like, just not me. Like someone else for real. And then they'll be like, oh, she's an actor, actor. And I'll be like, girl, yeah. It's giving that. Eek! Um... Like, I don't know. Maybe like a a lady from the wrong side of the streets. <laughs> anyway, I'm about to answer one more question. And then I'm about to watch some Netflix. Because this rat is giving. Oh, that is a good question. But oof, we're not doing a Christmas special. Sorry, friend. We don't have no time, baby. What's been your favorite episode of Tea and Coke? <sighs> Oh my gosh, well, skydiving was so fun. Jay, <laughs> I'm screaming. Skydiving was so fun. Thinking back, hindsight, it's so 20 and 20. Really jumped out of a plane. Really was in the sky. But my jumping partner, Sean, I felt like he wasn't going to risk his life. I trusted him. I loved it. The only thing was, thingy things were tight on, that was tight. But the jumping, I felt free like, yeah, that's my favorite episode. Because also I'm a daredevil type. I like like scary stuff. I like to like jump out of things and like feel like, ooh. And that was the extreme feeling of that. When I first jumped out, I was like, oh, this is the same feeling that I get when I'm on the roller coasters. And I was like, am I going to feel this the entire time? It's a long way to feel your stomach is in your eyebrows. But then after a while, my body was like, I guess this is what we're doing. And then it was just a blast. Skydiving. I have low battery. See, that's already a sign. All right, y'all. This has been very fun.
thank you for being bored with me. And, um, hey, stream what I didn't tell you, okay? It's always giving prep bag. I'm gonna log out though because I still got a ways to go and I need some phone battery. But love y'all. Talk to you later. Bye.